night inspection. Here's the early morning one. This is uh, a meth house. This is the kind of yards we see typical in meth houses. Collection of parts, garbage. Um, and this is stuff that Jason has to clean up. Jason, you have to clean a yard because you're going to make Jason, you're going to make Braden and I clean this yard, aren't you? This is what's going to happen, right? This isn't how you do this. The yard dries up instead of covering it. It's a complete disgusting mess. Jason, you were supposed to be on this house. Complete disgusting mess. So, let's go check this out. This was cleaned and now it's not. We kicked out the meth head tenants. Oh, we got a shower rod missing, shower curtain snailed up, and uh, I took the power out of this suite yesterday, last yesterday, because we can't have meth heads in here no more. And this place was swept up, and now it's not. Now we got work. You know, posters, killer shit on the walls. Yeah. Snot rags. Yeah. Yeah. Typical. So, Jason, who's going to clean this? You're going to say, I have to? Is that how this works? Hey. Panels. We removed the electrical panel, electrical for the basement downstairs so it isn't used. We took out the electrical for the laundry because it's optional <laughs> and I own it and it's contaminated. The furnace has been shut down because I can't smell nothing now. This place had a chance to air out overnight, but yesterday this was a pretty sad case. Braden and um, Helmet both couldn't breathe in here. Me, I'm different cat. So uh, Jason, I'm a licensed gas fitter in and for the province of Saskatchewan. I've determined that that furnace needs to be cleaned. I don't view it as safe. Uh, the duct work is a concern to me also. So I'm not sure who you can, you'll have to uh, explain that to any gas fitter you call that this has been deemed by a licensed Saskatchewan gas fitter as being unsafe. Okay.